in, in part of it. You know, it has been, it was interesting, Quint, last week we celebrated the 98th anniversary of the, of the WCOA, and we were at the, at the old City Hall, which is now the Museum of History, and Rob Overton was saying that when that was built in, 2000, in 1908, that it was built because the city of Pensacola wanted to show the world what it thought of itself, that it was, it was an up-and-coming city. And I said, Rob, we made that same argument in 2005 and 2006 with the I Maritime think, Park. Uh, people forget history. They yes. just assumed it just happened, and you know, and and you were there. I think I think you should write a book. I was thinking that the other day because somebody came to me and said they heard it. Somebody speak about downtown, and they never mentioned some of those type things, <laughs> right? You know, and um, yeah, I, I think the other thing we get calls from other cities. Um, you know, Wall Street Journal called me the other day about why has Pensacola become so vibrant, and somebody gave them my name, and I always say, you know, cities talk about we need outside investors. Well, outside investors are looking at the community and say, well, wait a minute, where's the inside investor? Right. If the people that live here aren't investing, why do they expect us who don't live here to invest? And I think you've also got to keep it up. You just can't declare victory because there's always communities out there trying to make a difference. Right, right. Mobile